How's it going guys? This is John McLennan and I'm here with GuitarControl.com. I want to show you a great lesson today. This one's going to be targeted for uh, perhaps people coming from playing acoustic guitar moving to electric. And uh, you may have learned, you know, a lot of what I call your cowboy chords, the basic open chords, you know, D, C, G. And uh, some of those chord voicings when you move them to electric guitar and say you start getting into rock and you're adding distortion to the guitar, um, I like to tweak them a little bit so that they work better with distortion on or in a rock setting. Perhaps, you know, if you're playing a heavier style music, maybe some ACDC or uh, something like that. So. Uh, here we go. So let's start off. Uh, be sure to click the link below with the tab, but let's say we take a G chord, okay? So here's your very common chord voicing, and I'm just going to call out the frets to you. 3, 2, open, open, 3, 3. And that's a great chord, but one of the things that I'll do is I'll remove the thirds from the chord. So, for instance, this B note, I'm not going to play that note. So, I'm just going to take that out and then my second finger is going to sort of arc over and I'm going to get a G. So now when I add some distortion, you know, sometimes when I have this note in there, the notes just kind of mush together, you know, so I like this chord a lot of the times. Alright, so let's keep going. So let's take a D chord now, and here's your typical, you know, folk voicing on acoustic guitar. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to omit the high string, so I'm just going to mute that, and then I'm going to get this chord. And right away, again, when you add this note, you know, as opposed to just has a little bit more rock sound to it, you know, and that's because basically what we're doing is we're creating a power chord out of the, out of the, uh, you know, open chord voicing. So be sure to click the link below and it shows you uh, more voicings in the tab as well and, uh, and try to apply some of these and you'll really hear the difference. So see you in the next video lesson. Thanks for watching.